Hey guys, King Adu here, bringing you a review of a browser called Brave. And why I'm doing this is because there is an ICO coming up in relation to Basic Attention Token. If you haven't heard of that yet, I'm going to cover that in a in a video coming up very soon. So this is this is leading up to that. We're going to be looking into BAT um, as an investment opportunity. Um, so if you're interested in this investment opportunity, hit subscribe because we're going to be covering it at different from different angles. Um, I actually even reached out to the team today um, as my professional life involves digital marketing. Uh, BAT is a digital marketing solution um, that's good for users and good for the people advertising, which I do a lot of. So I actually reached out them out to them today and got a really cool response from them. And I'm going to go more into that later. But first, um, I want to just talk about Brave and keep this on point. I went on a rant last video because um, I'm passionate about this stuff. But let's just get down into the weeds here of what is Brave. Brave is my new favorite browser. Brave is going to be your new favorite browser. <laughs> it is fast it was like you know back when you were using internet explorer and maybe you tried uh, firefox for the first time right okay you may remember that if you're old enough then there was this time where you switched from that from firefox or internet explorer and you and you signed up for chrome and you're like whoa chrome brave is the next browser to make you go whoa Try out Brave. Go to brave.com, download it. It's available on iOS, it's available on Android, and it is fast. Now let me tell you why it's fast. It blocks all of your ads for you. It has built-in ad blocking technology. They also don't sell out like other ad blockers. Some ad blockers are um, letting ads through. Um, Basically, they uh, they go to the people who want to advertise me, the advertiser, and they're like, well, we'll let you through our blocker if you pay this ridiculous amount of money. Well, that's lame. I don't want... <laughs> I'm not going to pay it. it. It's a bad system. Everyone loses. This fixes that. And BAT is the solution. BAT, basic attention token is the solution to making you happy and me as the advertiser happy and even the publishers happy and we're going to talk about that more so make sure you subscribe if you want to hear more about that but we're going to keep talking about this browser now what's really cool about it is because it's blocking the 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 uh, ads for you load times are about 50 percent faster if you're on mobile you have to get it especially if you pay for data Ask yourself right now, do you pay for data? I'm pretty sure everyone's like, well, duh. Very few people have unlimited plans anymore. If you pay for data, did you know that about 50% of what you're downloading is ads? You literally are paying to see an ad that somebody else paid for for you to see. It's, it's a broken system. And you shouldn't have to pay for that. Put Brave on your phone. Your phone will be faster. You won't see ads. It's a win-win. So, try out Brave. Now, um, Brave has some cool features. Um, and I kind of want to walk through what those features are real quick. So, I'm going to go over here. Um, and we're actually going to go to settings. And... On the left side of my screen, you're actually going to see the different things that you can do here. And I was playing around with it earlier, prepping for this. And, man, I, I, I just love it. I love this browser. I definitely owe credit to MD711 for shooting me this browser, uh, telling me how great it was and how fast it was. And I was hesitant. Um, I love Chrome. Maybe I'm getting old and senile, but I love Chrome. Um, and I'm switching over. I've got my uh, Android switched over. Um, I'm all about it. It's gonna save me. It's gonna save me a lot of time. Even the downloading is much much faster um, on every single page, and it's great. So here we are in settings, 
you, it has all the same settings as you would in a Chrome. You can set what your default search is. So if you use Amazon all the time, you can say, well, when I search in the search bar, I want it to search Amazon or Google, or maybe you don't like Google. You could do YouTube. So when you search King Adu, there I am. Good news, guys. YouTube.com backslash King of Do. I now have it, thanks to you guys. I got enough subscribers to be able to get that. Um, so that's really awesome. And I'm super glad no one else already had it. <laughs> so thank you from the bottom of my heart to every single one of you guys. We broke 100 subscribers the other, uh, the other day, yesterday. And I was stoked. I was like, this is unreal. Like, it is so cool to be connecting with you guys, getting to know you guys. So please follow the channel if you want to talk with me, send me messages. I love having conversation with you guys. I'm getting so many cool messages and so many good ideas for my channel too. So I really appreciate you guys um, helping me out with that. So um, the tabs, really cool tab features. You can choose whether you want it to open immediately and change the themes and the colors. And if you want the little icons, that's pretty normal stuff. And the security, here you go private data. Now you can actually have it clear your data every time you close, right? That's pretty cool. So you can actually uh, choose to uh, clear your browsing history, uh, your download history, your images and files, your cookies, autofill data, autocomplete, everything. Now I'll be real. Some of you in this cryptocurrency world, you're new and you're not familiar with what's legit and what's not legit, Brave is going to help you stay safe. Not 100%, but it's going to help. Okay? So keep that in mind, guys. Um, there are ads right now, normal ads, just like you probably saw before you watched this video or you're surfing the, the internet listening to me right now and you're seeing ads. Did you know that there's malware on those ads now like there's literally ways you can actually get malware to load with the ad it's new it's not everywhere but it's happening um something to keep in mind this is this will help protect you when you're on some shady sites the last thing you want is to get a key logger and someone to actually get your login to your wallet all right so, or, or your login to an exchange or something like that. Brave is going to keep you safe. Keep it secret. Keep it safe. I say that all the time. You got to actually take measures to protect yourself. Okay. Very cool that this browser has some of those features built in. Um, syncing is in beta. What's really cool is you can actually sync your settings. Um, so if you have an iPhone or an Android, it syncs with your computer. If you have multiple devices, maybe you even have tablets. Super cool, right? You don't you want to like have everything synced up, have all your um, tabs synced up, and maybe even your viewing history, so you you can seamlessly go from one device to another, right? It's like, oh man, I gotta go, but I want to finish watching King of Do or something like that. Well, hey, I'm in your browser history. If you pick up your phone and walk out the door, um, you can pick up right where you left off, right? You can get right back to it quickly. So um, cool things like that. Um, payments. Okay. This is different. This is definitely not in Chrome or any other browser on the planet. You can actually set up payment. It pays via Bitcoin. I'm sure they'll add Ethereum. In fact, I'm a thousand percent sure they're going to add Ethereum because that's essentially what basic attention token is. So essentially, you can choose your budget and the account amount that you, the actual balance um, you can see there on the screen um, will appear. And there's a next contribution date. So let me just sum it up for you. I'm not going to get into much detail, but essentially, when you surf the web, Brave is tracking your history and essentially building bank accounts to give these websites, right? So if you're on Reddit a lot, let's say you only use Reddit. If you if you had $5 here, 
eventually all that all five dollars is actually going to be given to write it directly okay um so that's how it works so as you surf the web you're actually like leaving it's like dropping candy behind you or pennies behind you as you walk right um so youtube like what you're using youtube if you use this browser and you and you want to do brave payments youtube would actually make money as well um the concept behind it the belief system is is that the that the people who create the content should get paid right so like kingadoo.com if i had some news website or something on there and you know i was publishing content um you could come and visit my site and actually you know leave money behind for the content and that's pretty cool so anyhow that's what that's what brave payments are I'm sure most of you won't use it. You're like, why would I pay for the internet? It's free. Um, on the other hand, some of you may actually believe in something enough and want to support something enough um, that you're willing to give them a little money, right? Maybe there's a local reporter who does some broadcast, uh, I don't know, reports on your favorite football team, basketball team, soccer team. Maybe, maybe... He writes content that's so compelling and so good, and you just want to support him so he can do more of it because he's doing it in his part time, right? I'm doing this part time, right? Uh, myself. So someone like me that's got a job and they just do it in their off time. You want to help him out, right? You wanna you wanna give back to them because you're passionate about what they're passionate about. You can do it using this system. So kind of a cool concept. Not sure how much it's used. But essentially, once a website earns one hundred dollars, um, Brave will actually contact them and make sure that they're aware they can collect their money. That's pretty cool. Moving on, uh, extensions. You guys are familiar with plugins in Chrome. Here we have some cool ones. Um, we have a password extension, um, a couple of them, uh, three password managers to be exact. You can view PDFs as well. Um, you can do that on, uh, you can download PDFs as well on the uh, mobile version. So pretty cool. You have a save to pocket, which is where you can like kind of save your articles and videos. It's kind of a cool little uh, extension to make that easier. And you have a torrent viewer. Some of you guys out there that enjoy torrents would probably really enjoy this particular extension. Now, um, there's plugins. Of course, there's like Adobe Flash support. Um, and then there's Google uh, WideVine support for those of you that, that need um, that type of support in your browser. Um, and then there's Shields to shield you against different types of ads and things. So that's what the browser offers. That's what makes it different than Chrome. If I hit um, add new tab you guys can actually see up here in the top left I have successfully uh, blocked 62 ads 59 trackers I, th I think I think the general public has no idea how much you're being tracked when you surf online it would blow your mind um, it, it estimates it saves seven seconds of my life and that's pretty cool um, uh, on my desktop, I'm still primarily using Chrome because I'm trying to switch over. Um, I'm, I'm doing it on, I'm 100% switched over on my mobile device. I am working on the transition at work. Um, it's, it's just a personal thing that it kind of just takes me time mentally to kind of switch over. So I just got Brave set up and running a few days ago on here, but I just, I'm not using it actively right now. I'm still... Uh, uploading videos and everything via YouTube so um, on the Chrome so I'm working my way over but I, I'm, I'm, I'm really excited about this browser um, I'm making the switch I'm going to make the full switch it just takes time with me I highly encourage you to go check it out um, browse faster and safer with brave guys that's 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 it it's simple um, I shared it with some associates at work and uh, they think it's a cool concept. They love that it's fast. They love that they don't see ads. It totally makes sense to the average person. And so I think this could have some wide adoption. 
which is exciting. And that's also what's exciting about BAT. So we're going to cover BAT coming up. Make sure you subscribe. Okay. Uh, make sure you like the video as well. I really appreciate it. I really appreciate it. If you click the link in my description to go to Steam it. If you, if you have a Steam it account, go over there. If you don't, go create one. I don't know what you guys are waiting for. Like literally, I have 100 people plus following this. I should have 100, 100 upvotes over there because you'll get money for it. You get money for upvoting just like you do on Reddit. You get money for uh, leaving comments that are good, that people like. You make money for upvoting my video, literally. Like, go to Steam it, guys. It's kind of crazy. And when I first got into cryptocurrency, I thought I was like, what's, what's the Steam it thing? That seems weird. I don't need another site like that. I use Reddit. I have completely stopped using Reddit. It is 100% of what I use. I am literally making a reasonable amount, not a ridiculous amount. It's not a get rich quick or anything, but I literally am getting paid for my time. And it's pretty cool. Go get on Steam it, use Steam it, um, and upvote my videos. Of course, help support the channel, help support my daughter's college fund. Um, man, what a responsibility that is. Anyhow, guys, I appreciate you uh, so much. Uh, keep coming back for more. We're gonna be covering more on BAT soon. I've got some uh, a huge list of things that you guys are asking for. If you don't know, I actually write down your requests. I have them all, and um, so keep them coming. Uh, so far, I've been able to fulfill almost all of them. Um, and I, I, I think I have, actually. I think I'm caught up. You guys are actually asking for the content you want to see, and then I bring it um, because I know it's what you want to see. Why would I do anything different? Plus, I'm learning from you guys. You guys are helping me so much. Um, exposing me to so many cool new things. So I really appreciate it. I'm going to talk to you soon. I'm going to do another video tonight. Um, so stay tuned. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss it. Shoot me a message. Leave a comment. Upvote. All the things. I appreciate it so much. I'm King Adu. May the force be with you. And I'll talk with you soon.